Can you top this? Well. This is another little story I want to tell you. Now, this really happened. I know you probably won't believe this. <clears throat> this is about a, a friend of mine out in Phoenix, Arizona, by the name of Fred Kerr. I used to work for him at a little nightclub he has there. And uh, <laughs> he, uh, I moved to Nashville, and uh, <clears throat> I'd been there a couple of years, and uh, I used to call him every now and then, see how things were going, you know, and I called one time, his wife, and uh, she said he'd been in an automobile accident. And uh, <clears throat> so, uh, well, I went out to Phoenix about, uh, oh, I guess about three or four weeks after he'd had his accident, and I happened to go by this uh, little nightclub where, that he owned, and he, he was working there during the day. He was back uh, on the job already. And he, he'd been over here. He was around 70 years old, I guess. He'd been here since he was six years old, but he still spoke with a little bit of an accent. Nah, wouldn't that get you there? And so, so he wanted to tell me just how serious his accident was. And what he wanted to say was this. He wanted to say, you know, Marty, if you'd have seen me the first week, you'd have said, you'll never make it. That's how bad a shape he was in. But he didn't tell it to me like this. He said it like this. He said, you know, Marty, if you was going to see me the first week, you were going to say, he didn't game. 